Hi everyone, I am Lithium. We are back with some more Would You Rather. Now, again, let's address the elephant in the room. I, my voice is low. That's because I am sick. I woke up with no voice today. And if I try to speak with my normal voice, it sounds like that. I'm sorry you just cringed right now, but I am not forcing it. That's what my voice sounds like when I take my normal tone. So I have to go a little lower, it relaxes my vocal cords, and then I can still speak. Now I just recorded this after the would you press the will you press the button. So that's why I still have my low voice. I don't plan to record a ton of them, but I got told that it would be funny for actually for me to actually go there. So anyway, let's get on with it. Only use Windows. Or only use Macintosh. I never used Mac before. I don't know, uh, like, it's not a question that you can give on to me, because Mac the only Macintosh I ever played with, I was like, seven or eight year old, my father had a Macintosh computer in his home. And then Steve Jobs got fired, and then he got hired back, and then he made the company great, he died off, and then it's going back again. It's like, I get having this image of Steve Jobs taking a train, swinging at full speed, and he goes, here you go guys! do something with that and then Tim Cook sits on it and he's like man that's going way too far too, way too fast then he puts on the brakes and he's like okay how do I speed up again okay hold on cough okay never be able to eat Chipotle again or never eat dessert again oh my god this is actually a great dilemma for me because I have a sweet tooth and I love spicy Oh my god, but then again, I don't have dessert all the time in my house, but I do have Chipotle all the time in my house, so I could live my life without dessert. I can just eat sugar. I can eat something that's sugary and that's not a dessert. Like a cookie is not exactly a dessert, is it? Is it? Is it? Okay, never eat dessert again. Damn. People don't like the Chipotle. Oh, did he mean the restaurant Chipotle or did he mean the sauce? I mean the sauce, so yeah. Would you rather? Well, I think the website bugged on me. Never mind. Would you rather serve seven years in a rough prison or kill and eat your pet dog? I don't have a dog. Does that count for me? Oh, well, let's just say it's my cat. I would not like to kill and eat my cat. But then again, when you, you serve seven years in prison, prison isn't as bad in Canada as it, as it might be in the US. I don't know. Well, like, you can study in prison. You can have TV, you can have a gym. If you're religious, you can have prayer times. You can have a lot of stuff, and you're better fed than the median classes. So, yeah, I don't see how in a rough prison, though. Does that mean that I have to pick the goddamn soap? Oh, but my cat will be alive then. But I won't have anyone to live for him. But I don't want to eat my cat. Like, killing him, I could do that, but eating him, you know, that's like crossing a line. Okay, would you rather have all the fingernails and toenails removed quickly, or deep paper cuts on the web page? <laughs> oh, 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 that is, oh, oh, no! Oh, this is actually one of my younger days nightmare. I would be so... That was like my worst nightmare when I was a kid. Seriously. Oh, you... No, no, no. I, take my fingernails and my toenails. Oh. Oh, like, I know you guys. I know. I know that a webbing can heal. Paper cuts can heal. Oh, oh. Oh, no, no. Take my finger. Oh. Oh, next question, I need to think about something else. Would you rather get caught cheating or catch your partner cheating? Doesn't matter, have sex. <laughs> it doesn't say have sex. <laughs> 69. It doesn't say have sex, but I'd rather get... Then again, the feeling must be... I didn't think that one through, maybe because I'm sick. Would you rather get swine flu or get West Nile? What is West Nile? Well, I'm still a young man, so swine flu, I would live through it. So, would you rather live in a giant shoe, or live in a giant peach? That's reference to two movies, I believe. Yeah, I think there's a movie I watched when I was younger, that was about a giant peach that was rolling through town and stuff, and sorry, I mess around with my hair a lot, 
I'm not satisfied with it, but... A giant peach, like, do you get endless food? I'd like to live in a giant shoe, but is it a worn shoe? A giant peach, it does it... it a peach can expire, though, so it'll get very nasty with time. So yeah, I'd rather live in a giant shoe. It's more house materials than a giant peach. Seriously, people, the peach can grow bad, you know? It will grow bad. Everything will turn green, it will stink, and you're living in there. All your shit is there. It's not like you can just move out instantly. It will rot and stuff. That is disgusting! Would you rather lose your mind or lose your significant other? I would have my... I, I lost my significant other three times in life, so yeah. I can lose my... I can keep my mind sane anyway. I don't... I already don't have a mind. By the way, I might as well lose my significant other while I'm at it. Would you rather speak all your thoughts out loud or never speak at all, not even in sign language? Um, I'd rather... Actually, that's something I would like to aspire to. If it didn't wound so many people, I would like to speak all my thoughts all my thoughts out loud. Because, now that you think about it, nobody can misinterpret what you say. You say your thoughts, you say what you're thinking. They might not like that, but you're honest while you're saying it. Being frank is something that I've always wanted to be in life. Would you rather always have mud in your shoes or always have a pebble in your shoe? Well, mud you can't clean easy. Have a, that goes back to... The question where, uh, where, where, the question in the last episode, where, that was like, the first episode I mean. Would you rather uh, have a swear in every commas in the sentences, or would you rather get punched in the face when you say a bad word? Like, at some point, you get used to it. So, I would get used to have a pebble in my shoe. I can get used to have mud in my shoes, but I can clean the pebble much faster than the mud. Like, at some point, it's just take the shoes, clean it, it becomes a habit, second nature, so have a pedal in your shoe. There we go, 55% of people agree with me. So, would you rather spend Monday to Saturday knocking down the walls of China for the rest of, the, of your life, or never be able to leave your bedroom? Ah, oh, uh, can people come into my bedroom? Can people come and... Can I expand my bedroom? If I can expand my bedroom, put stuff in it, ask people to get stuff in it, then that's fine with me, I'll leave my bedroom. I don't even care about the Wall of China. Really. So, would you rather have your life be narrated by Morgan Freeman, or have your life be narrated by James Earl Jones? Oh my god, I actually loved Morgan Freeman. Who doesn't love him? And I love his voice as well, so Morgan, you're up. Get <laughs> oh my god, people love the Freeman! Okay, time, time, I still got time. Would you rather be male with female features and body parts, or be female with male features and body parts? What kind of food or shit are you actually asking me about? Like, would I rather be male but have boobs and a vagina? Or would I rather be, be well, what different... This is some gender fuck right there. I don't. I don't even know. I. I, I feel like I could shit. Uh, how am I male if I have female features and body parts? Like boobs are an actual body part, isn't it? So how am I? Do I have boobs and a cock, or female with male features and body parts? Wait a second. Both have. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't. They're both. Now that you think about it, when you mix the two together, they're both the same. So I'm just skipping this one. What kind of gender fuck was that? Would you rather be only able to speak in lol speak or only be able to speak in or to type in leak speak? I actually came up with a language when I was at work at some point uh, that was called geek speak. And what is lol speak? I'd rather have. You would get so annoying. But voice chat is a thing, so I can only type in lead speak, and I can speak in normal speech. So I can just speak to people and tell them to scrub without typing. So, uh, would you rather perform pity thievery for a living or perform grand larceny for a living? Go broke or go home. So grand larceny, here it comes, rob banks and stuff. Would you rather get toe to toe, go toe to toe with Michael Myers? Shrek? You mean Shrek? Oh, Michael Myers. Okay, the guy with the mask in Halloween. I thought Mike Myers. 
the guy who does the voice of Trek, the guy who does Austin Powers. I thought I would have to go toe-to-toe. I would love to go toe-to-toe -to -toe against Mike Myers. That guy is awesome. Or try to take down Freddy Krueger. So, the kitchen knife or the machete? Wait, 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 wait. That's Jason. Never mind. Freddy can go inside your dream. Michael Myers, you can just kill him and be done. He's pretty predictable as far as I'm concerned. So yeah, go toe-to-toe -to -toe against Michael Myers. Why not? Now, okay, last one. Would you rather absolutely reek of armpits for the rest of your life, or use your sense of smell completely? But then, if I lose my sense of smell, how do I know I'm not reeking of armpits? Oh, you, but I'd rather lose my sense of smell. That sucks because I can't taste anymore, but I don't want to reek of armpits like nobody can go through me, uh, near me, and I smell myself. That smell would make me crazy. So, okay, that has been Would You Rather. Thanks everyone so much for tuning in. Like savagely, the pure madness will be back with some more. See ya.